Right, remember this? This was our paper bike, and actually I enjoyed doing it tremendously. Of course, it was a test piece when we were looking at whether the strength of the paper would hold a fat boy. We were also testing the gear drive, but mostly it was a test piece on the paper, and to be honest, I thought it was a resounding success. Now, there were a couple of things that worried me about it. It had a little bit of flexibility in the frame that I didn't quite like. The gear ratio was an 8 to 1. Maybe I should have made it 6 to 1. That sort of stuff. But... I learned a huge amount from it, really enjoyed doing it, and now I'm going to do it again. But I'm not going to make a bike, I'm actually going to make a trike. Now Luke is involved in making a trike, where he's got two wheels at the front and one wheel at the rear, and although that's a really good design and it's been used in tons of vehicles, I actually like it the other way around, two wheels at the back and one wheel at the front. So me and Luke are involved in making trikes of different configuration, and I can see a race in the car park coming up. But I still have to build my trike. Now, I took an original bike and the measurements from that bike to make this frame. And it was a BMX bike, obviously. When I'm doing something like a trike, what I've done is I've had a look at the various trikes around. Picked one I like, which was the CA Trike Expedition. Lovely vehicle. So I thought I would copy that. And the CA Trike has got the same configuration as Luke's trike. That is, two at the front, one at the back. So I'm going to make some ab adaptations to it in that I'm putting two wheels at the back, obviously. But the basic trike is going to be those measurements and those angles. And I've took the time and trouble to drop some plans and here they are. So if you want those plans, just stop the video and write it all down. It's all there for you and you can copy it and um, make yourself a trike to those plans because they're the kind of things that will be standard and they fit me. So I'm five foot eight, no idea what that is in centimetres. But if you uh, are a little bit taller, then obviously put a few centimetres on for where your um, pedals are going to go. But in order to make that trike, I've redesigned the sticks into this. It's a stronger version, taking up quite a few of people's suggestions, and I've busily made a whole bunch of those to be able to make the frame on the trike. So the frame on the trike is going to be used the plans that we just um, looked at. They're going to be using those sticks machines, but it's going to be using one other thing. We talked about this in all about axles. This is a axle, surprisingly enough. And I bought it from Fun Bikes for 20 quid. Now that's amazingly cheap. That axle will do the job that I want it to do, no worries at all, and I've got a beautiful axle, and you'll notice flange A, flange B. Flange A takes a cog, flange B takes a brake disc. Here's the cog, 6mm pitch, uh, 68 tooth cog. And on my motor, because I'm going to use the 500 watt motor that we got for 20 quid, talk about bringing things together, We've got a little drive cog to give us a 6 to 1 ratio. So we've got a nice ratio on the gears, we've got a powerful motor, we've got a very good axle, and we've got our redesigned sticks that we're going to put together to build a trike. And that trike is something that I really um, will highly likely keep. Now we make a lot of stuff here, so things here don't really last that long. They'll be there for a while and then we chop them up for parts. Otherwise we'd be knee deep in bits. I mean, we've already got a whole lot of things around. We couldn't really keep everything that we make, so we tend to recycle it. But the trike is something I'm thinking about keeping. And so I'm going to take a bit more care over it, spend a bit more time on it, and probably a little bit more money, and try and do a nice job of it. So that's the plan, and that's what's up and coming up in the next series of videos. But I thought I'd give you a heads up, really thank people for their uh, input onto the redesign of the sticks, show you the plans, so you had some plans if you felt like building yourself a trike, and then the rest of it is going to be a build video, and then, like I say, highly likely for me and Luke to race each other to Asda. So I hope you enjoyed the video, hope you found it helpful, and thank you very much for watching.